What's up guys, this is Mo from See That, and today we have the second Legions of Collectors box. This theme is TV, and it has, um, Arrow, obviously as a front cover. The front is a bit smashed up again, but you can't help that for, uh, shipping. And then Flash and Supergirl, of course, um, which... The finales, Christopher Girl finish up, Flash and Arrow will be finishing up later in the month, late month. So let's see what they have in here. Shot again. Oof. Well, it has Justice League panels, the Flash, Superman, Star Labs. And here we have Legends of Tomorrow, right? So Adam, the Legion of Collectors, and, and then the Supergirl are right, on the patch. Oof. So the shirt is Arrow theme. Looks very cool. Uh, black T-shirt with the green printed material. So need the camera. Lopsided in a Oof. So it is Arrow Star City, the picture of D the CW's arrow. The only weapon, Oliver Queen. The Star Cities, the arrowhead carries up the S. It's pretty cool design of it. And here we have things cooking now. The Flash DC Comics number 123. The DC Comics Legion of Collectors uh, cover variant I would assume. That's cool. So this is the ongoing New 52 version of that 123. Ooh, and then we have the two exclusive stuff Let's go with the this one the rock candy final collectible exclusive supergirl so besides supergirl this is a comic tv version besides that we have the comic supergirl wonder woman uh modern bat batgirl that's the batgirl burn side when she gets the new suit. Uh, Harley Quinn, the classic version of Batgirl here. And then the Batman v Superman, Wonder Woman. So it's interesting that Harley doesn't get a variant, but it's cool. So, as long, along with being an exclusive sculpt, it's actually different than the comic Supergirl because all of these have different sculpts to them to make their variants more different, obviously. Let's open this up. It's pretty cool. Uh, clam shell packaging. The silver backing that's not part of it. And then the display stand right down here. Yeah, you see how pegs are different. This one is larger and this one is smaller. It corresponds to these two pegs here. So you would basically line it up with her heels. Show it this way. You would line it up with her heels. Ah, her legs are shorter than what stance is. So I'm assuming the legs are supposed to be stretchable because then this will be too wide a base to do it then. It's weird. Unless it's like this where the peg is outside just holding onto it. But anyway, this is the Supergirl sculpt. Very animated appearance. It's um, cartoon like. The head is bigger than the body proportion. Uh, hair's nice. Cape flow quite 
well. Um, it has the pattern. Take that off the face. Has a suit mesh pattern of Supergirl. Suit. It's accurate. And the cape goes in a bit. The high boots, little heels, pleated skirt. The belt, I think, would be more golden, but mm, yellow is not a bad color. So that's pretty cool. So that's Supergirl. And the other thing we have here is Flash number 341 in the series, a pop television exclusive version of Jay Garrick, which if you've follow up in the show you know who this guy is but here we have Flash Barry Allen is the Flash Reverse Flash Captain Cold and Captain Cold Unmasked so this is the only one from the second season of the Flash which is cool get this guy out Brown hair, check. This one obviously does not have a spring because the head's still on solidly. So that also makes the head articulation more stiff. But overall, it's the same. Uh, gloves, belt are painted. Some very dirty gray or brown. The uh, suit has a very nice lightning emblem on it. Pants, red boots, the hat, the mercury rings, wings on the side of it makes it very cool. Uh, uh, it's a bit of a spray piece of paint up there. It's weird because this is a separate... He looks like they cut the head in half and then glued it on. Because I see the gaps where the hairline meets against and I see some plastic dust from it. Yeah. And I see the glue they used to put it on too. It's a very thin layer of glue along the top. And then you see here, two little openings here. We didn't seal it all the way. This is how it was cut. I'm assuming it started here and they went over here and it started a little bit higher than what they went should with. Went cut it with. And other than that, the details are all there. It's very nice, very stable. <laughs> Very stable, huh? So, this is Earth 2 Flash, Jay Garrick. Very nice. So, um, I don't remember what next, next month's flu crate's gonna be. Uh, I think it might be girl themed crate I'm not or is that uh, the woman attire crate from Marvel hmm. well I don't know well I'll see you next month for no oh. next next month for loot crates from nice legends of the legions of collector collectors and you will catch the monthly moot crate reviews along with the marvel collectors core that i'll do that's offset from this so get this one since may last month i got uh Marvel, so 
Yeah. So yeah. So next week I'll get blue crate and the Marvel crate, and then the month after that, July, will be the third box for the Legions of Collectors and another Loot Crate box. So, I'll see you guys then. Check out my other reviews on my channel. Uh, see you guys. Adios.